guys in at different parts each week? So it's a lot. You know, just um, that is a definitely a family culture in that room, and it's the next man up mentality that you know my brother goes down after come in and be ready to play to you know pick up where he left off, and there can't be any drop off. So you know, Coach Mo holds that room to a high standard, and you know, the guys do a great job. You know, starting with Dylan and the older guys, and uh, pushing each other to to learn and be ready week in and week out, especially for the younger guys. Patrick, Paul, Mike, John, specifically on on Drew on the offensive line. How did you kind of see him manage those six weeks or so when he went from starting to not starting? How how do you think he handled that? And, and maybe who or how did some of his teammates kind of keep him up and keep him focused where he could come in and start and play all these last couple weeks? He handled it well. Uh, he was still, you know, in the film room doing extra pass sets after practice, getting in extra work, watching film as if he was the starter. I mean, it's shown the last couple of games that he's been able to come in and play you know, very productive and hold, hold down the left side for us. So it's, it was really good to see that, um, see how mature he was to handle that, um, going from a starter to not playing to back being a starter and still preparing as if he was the starter, staying humble and being ready to go week in and week out. Josh, a couple things first. When you guys are in two tights, what does that change for you? It seems like Missouri had to keep nine guys in the box at times when you guys were in that. And then also, what does Vanderbilt's defense do well? And specifically, why is Zach Cunningham the kind of linebacker he is? Uh, we're in two side, two tights. You know, we, um, we have various you know personnel packages, formation looks, and, and different things. I mean, we are in a two tight end set. You know. Um, a lot of teams are going to, you know, load the box, just two tight ends in the game. So, I mean, there's a lot you can do out of that, and we've been able to be productive, take advantage of different looks, and um, make plays out of those sets. And, uh, you know, Vanderbilt's a very disciplined defense. I mean, their red zone stats show it, um, you know, number one, number two in the country in red zone stats. So, um, we have to be ready to go. You know, Zach Cunningham, he's obviously the leader of their defense, and um, he does a great job making tackles, setting the defenses. You know, he's, he's an explosive player in the middle, and we have to be aware of that as well. So we have to go out, execute our game plan, just like we have to do week in and week out to be successful and take advantage of the opportunities that are there. I'm kidding, John. Liz.